Hello, welcome to 9design3d. Today we will make basic cargo pants without cloth simulation. Choose some faces from your character's body. In the edit mode with 3, you can go this. Shift it to duplicate P for selection. Z to wireframe, select half of the vertices. In object mode, add mirror modifier and don't forget to check clipping. Now, with the proportional edit, you can active it with O. Select your vertices and G to move for fitting to your character's body. You can scale some edge lines, move some vertices for fitted. Control tab to going sculpt mode. You can choose your grab brush if the vertices make me sick. I always use this method for little details. With your grab brush, you can give some a bit fabric shape, a bit cargo pants shape to your character clothes like that. If you want with crease, you can add another details. But I want to leave it as a basic mesh, so I didn't make remesh. In edit mode, choose some faces from the belt, shift it to duplicate, P4 selection. You can scale some part of it. For belt details, shift it to duplicate face. Add some loop cuts in of it and G to move in Y axis. Choose your vertices and merge at center with M. Make same thing for other belt details with the same method. Shift it to duplicate your faces, add some loop cut, and G to move. If you want, you can add another details for this. I want to make basic. For the front part of it, shift it to duplicate faces again, P4 selection. You can extrude some edges, or if you want, you can delete some part of it. E to extrude and make it longer around the pelvis. For pockets, you can choose another faces from it. Shift it to duplicate and P4 selection. You can move in Y axis a bit. For another pocket, we make same method. For another details to your pocket, you can make same thing. Shift it to duplicate your faces and P selection. You can add another loop cut for sharper edges for your pockets. If you want, you can add another different details to your pants how you want. Anytime you can go to Sculpt mode and change something on it. Choose your belt details and P4 selection. Choose your belt, select all faces with A, E to extrude, right click and Alt S to scale. Add another loop cut for sharper edges. Make same thing for the belt detail. E to extrude, right click and Alt S to scale. I am continuing to making this process for all pockets and details to our car cargo pants. You can add loop cuts in or of it for sharp edges.
For the trousers leg, choose your faces, shift it to duplicate, P4 selection. Make as the same method in here. Before the textures, we will mark seam and unwrap some, some parts of the trouser. Select edge lines, right click and mark seam for this. A to select all U, unwrap, or UV map will be look like that. I downloaded this fabric from the ambientcg.com with the 2K. Before this, go to add-ons, write node wrangler, check, it will be active. Choose your principal BSDF and Control shift t Select your all maps. It's a bit big. In the mapping nodes, you can scale a bit. For the pockets, if you want, you can make unwrap with mark seams, or if you don't want all the if you don't want to wear details on it, you can use a smart UV project. Add everything to our pants material. For detail of it, you can add second part of the material and click new material section. With the picker, get your color, assign and set a bit dark. If you want, you can choose different colors or different fabrics. And add some detail in texture paint how you want. I will make same process with assign my second material. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. If I miss something, please tell me in the comments. See you later in new projects.